Purdue Research Foundation Office of Technology Commercialization moves Purdue innovations to the public. Among those innovations is a low-cost, flexible micro-robotic device that provides sufficient articulation and dexterity for surgeons to perform more effective and safer lumbar discectomy procedures. The technology was co-invented by David Capillary, an assistant professor, and Benjamin Johnson, a PhD candidate, both in Purdue School of Mechanical Engineering, and Brian A. Cole, an orthopedic surgeon from New Jersey. Lumbar discectomies are a very common procedure. There's about 300,000 cases per year in the United States. Now, the challenges are it's a very small workspace for the surgeon, so it has limited movement space for the surgeon to work around in. Uh, there's also limited uh, visibility in the workspace. Uh, typical tools are rigid, so have no articulation, so it makes it challenging for the surgeon. And due to these circumstances, um, it can be risky to, to have some possible damage to the spinal column or, or, uh, or spinal cord or nerves in the workspace. Capillary and his team are developing a system of micro-robotic manipulators and end effector tools designed specifically for lumbar micro-discectomies. So our technology is uh, actually a teleoperated robotic system. So the surgeon can control our system remotely, either from the operating room or from a different building or even across the country. The system allows for multiple manipulators to be used at once and controlled simultaneously from a single control unit. So our system allows for teleoperated control of multiple manipulators in the workspace. So you can use more than one manipulator at a time. It allows a camera to be repositioned in the workspace to get more visibility. We have articulated instruments as opposed to this rigid uh, instruments. So that gives wrist-like movements to the surgeon, so more dexterity in the workspace. Uh, also what is neat is we 3D print our, our end effectors, our manipulators, using a, a new uh, multi-material 3D printing technique so we can have rigid and uh, flexible components so we can really shrink down very complicated mechanisms into a small workspace. Uh, they can actually be disposable and you can save a lot of costs in the sterilization. The versatile system is said to be the first robotic system for lumbar discectomies of its kind and could make a significant impact in performing lumbar discectomies more efficiently and safely. Currently we have prototype two uh, surgical instruments. We have a nerve retractor tool um, which is an articulated instrument uh, which has a blunt tip and is used to move the nerve uh, out of the way during the procedure. And we also have a, grasper, a grasping tool which is used to actually graft a herniated material of the disc and move it out of the workspace. And we've tested each of these instruments against uh, the current ones that are on the market and they've met or exceeded the design requirements and, uh, for these uh, applications. So we're pretty excited about where the technology is right now. This technology has been patented through the Purdue Research Foundation's Office of Technology Commercialization and is available for license. Companies are interested can license this technology to help uh, design and come up with a new surgical system for this lumbar discectomy procedure. To find more information about this and other Purdue technologies, visit prf.org/otc.